This video will show you how to perform general maintenance on your SawStop compact table saw. Your compact table saw was designed to minimize maintenance. With minimal care, you can keep your saw in efficient and safe working condition. It is important to keep the interior of the saw free of accumulated sawdust, wood chips, and other debris. Though it is normal to have some dust collect inside the saw, periodically check for dust inside the motor cover and the dust collector. Take precautions before working on the saw. Turn off the power switch. Unplug the saw. For an extra measure of safety, lock out the power switch. We recommend using a vacuum unit and a brush to remove any dust buildup. If you choose to use compressed air to get any persistent dust moving, it's always good practice to wear a dust mask or respirator. The first step in the maintenance process is removal of the throat insert and blade. We recommend wearing gloves while handling the blade. Using the provided wrenches, remove the arbor nut. If the arbor nut or washer are dropped while removing, it can be retrieved through the brake cartridge access door or by tipping the saw to the back and allowing it to slide out the dust port. Next, remove the brake cartridge. Open the cartridge access door using the flat end of one of the blade wrenches. Turn the red cartridge key clockwise to remove. Pull on the body of the brake cartridge to remove. Remove the accessory tray at the rear of the saw. To thoroughly clean out any dust collected in the motor housing, remove the screws from the motor cover. There are three screws on the back and two on the side of the saw with the handle. The motor cover is much easier to remove with the blade bevel angle tilted to 45 degrees. If the saw is on the CTSFS folding stand, the motor cover can be removed from the bottom of the saw. If the saw is on a workbench, stand the saw up on the right side with the handles facing up. This will give you easier access to the motor cover. Raise the blade to the maximum blade height. Vacuum out any dust buildup around the motor, housing, and covers. Use a brush or rag and vacuum to clear out built-up dust from the dust extraction port. In order to ensure smooth operation of the blade height adjustment system, cleaning and reapplying grease to the U-joint and the front alignment bracket is recommended. If you notice any drag or lobing while adjusting the blade height, a little grease should help clear it up. This is easily accomplished while the motor covers are off. With the blade at its maximum height, clean off the alignment bracket with a rag. Reapply grease to the side of the alignment bracket that is exposed with the motor cover removed. While you are working on the motor cover side, apply a small amount of grease to the spiral shaft just below the elevation carriage. Lower the blade to its minimum height and apply a small amount of grease to the top of the spiral shaft as well. Finally, move to the other side of the saw, open the cartridge access door, and remove the cartridge retaining key and cartridge to get access to the U-joints. Clean off the U-joints with a rag or brush to remove any excess dust buildup. Using the height adjustment wheel, Rotate the system through several full rotations, cleaning the U-joint as it turns until all dust has been removed. Continue turning the height adjustment wheel and reapply grease to the U-joints and the interface between the U-joint and the trunnion bracket. Be sure to get a good amount of grease into the middle of the U-joint where the yokes interface with the ball coupling. Cycle the blade through several elevation cycles all the way up and all the way down. Recheck each area for liberal grease application before replacing the motor covers. Once everything is clean and greased, rotate the bevel to 45 degrees to enable replacement of the motor cover. Insert the five screws that were removed at the start of this process. That's it. You have learned how to perform general maintenance on your SawStop compact table saw. If you have questions, contact SawStop service.